Welcome to Gray and Matt. We are asked to solve this problem. We have a rectangle and inside this rectangle are two circles. And we are required to find the area of the yellow region outside these circles but inside the rectangle. Okay, so first thing that we have to do is we need to draw a line from this center of the smaller circle and draw a, a line towards the center of the larger circle so let this be the center so next is we draw a horizontal line from this side of the rectangle to the center of this circle and Next is we draw a horizontal line from the center of the circle to the right. And we draw a vertical line from the center of this smaller circle. And we have to form a right triangle. Okay, so next is we draw a line from the top most part of the bigger circle and downwards to the center of this big circle and since this is actually the radius of the larger circle and as you can see the height of this rectangle is 4 and the radius is actually half of this side so this is 2 so since this is the radius this is also 2 and actually this is an unknown radius this is the unknown radius so we go to this is r and next is we draw a vertical line from the center of the smaller circle and we label this as r and also from the center to the right we label this as r Okay, so next is we consider this distance. This distance is actually 2. And therefore, this distance is actually 3. That is 3. So if that is 3, and this is actually r, and this would be, this distance should be. 3 minus r. And next, as we consider this distance, this distance is actually the distance from the bottom of the rectangle up to the center of the larger circle, and that would be equal to 2. And if this is 2, then this is actually also 2. And this distance, this one, is actually a part of this 2, but you need to subtract this one. Right? So this becomes 2 minus R. Okay, so next is, as you can see, I have already highlighted this right triangle. It is the red right triangle. And this red right triangle, as you can see, as we derived earlier, the hypotenuse is 2 plus r square is equal to the shorter length, which is 2 minus r. So this is 2 minus r square plus 3 minus r we are using Pythagorean theorem because this is a right triangle to solve for r okay so next is where this 2 plus r so that would be r square plus 4 here plus 4 equal to 2 square or 
4 minus 4 r plus r square is equals 9 minus 6 r plus r square. Okay, so we notice that we can cancel this r square. And we can cancel this also for. So remaining we have 4 r is equal to negative 4 r plus r square plus 9 minus 6 r. So simplifying we have r square and for the r we have negative 6 and negative 4 is negative 10 minus 4. So we have negative 14 r. Then plus 9 is equal to 0. And we are going to solve this resulting quadratic equation. Okay, so next is I choose to solve this by completing the squares. So by completing the squares, we need to copy this in this 14R plus the third term, which is 14 divided by 2 is 7. So that becomes 49 equal to negative 9, then plus 49. So we have here R minus 7 square is equal to 14. So we need to take the square root of both sides. This becomes r minus 7 is equal to the square root of 40. That will be, this becomes square root of 2 or 2 times 20 or 4 times 10. So that would be 2 square root of 10 plus or minus. And if we put this negative 7 on the left hand side, we have r is equal to 7 plus or minus the square root of 2 square root of 10. Okay, so in this case, we will only use the negative answer because the negative answer will give us a value of r which is less than 3 and less than 2 because the positive answer will be greater than 2 or 3 and it will be a negative value for 2 minus r and 3 minus r also. Okay, so now for the final step is we can find the area of this yellow region that is area is equal to the area of this rectangle then that is 4 times 5 and we need to subtract the area of the larger circle minus pi times r square but r square the radius is 2 so pi times 2 square then minus pi times 7 minus 2 square root of 10 square okay so next is we focus on this square in this so 7 minus 2 square root of 10 square so it will be equal to 49 minus 7 times 2 is 14 but we need to multiply it by 2 so we have 28 times square root of 10 then plus 2 square is 4 times the square root of 10 square will be 40 so this becomes 49 minus plus 40 is actually equal to 89 minus 28 square root of 10 
away. So now this becomes area is equal to 20 minus pi times hours and plus this is actually 89 minus 28 square root of 10. Okay, so simplifying further, we have area is equal to 20 minus, this becomes 93, and this becomes 93 minus 28 square root of 10 times 5 square units. And that is all our answer. So thank you for watching until the end of the video. Please like the video if you like our solution. And don't forget to subscribe to the channel and hit the bell icon. So you will be updated for more math videos like this. Thank you. Bye.